Our other big story at five, a search for a suspect after an 11 year old says she was grabbed by a stranger. Orlando police say that suspect lured the girl in with a Disney keychain. This happened along Rapper Dairy Road at the Blossom Corner Apartments that's south of State Road 408 near Curry Ford Road. New Six's Jerry Askin is following this story. And Jerry, Orlando police say this guy also told the girl not to say anything to her parents. Lisa, and really it's just sad, scary, and that guy was just dead wrong. Police say he actually offered her $3, that 11-year-old girl. And right now I've learned that actual incident happened here at these apartments right behind me. And we are waiting for Orlando to uh, police to release a suspect, a sketch of the suspect. Orlando police, I've learned, are adding patrols here on Rapper Dairy Road near Curry Ford Road. That's where investigators say a man driving a white SUV with some front end damage approached an 11 year old girl and her seven year old sister who were outside playing. This all happened Sunday around 6 p.m. when he grabbed the 11 year old girl's arm and even asked her for a kiss. According to police, he's an older Hispanic man, possibly in his 50s. Christina Spinks lives nearby and has two kids. Does it make you upset to hear that? Oh, absolutely, especially in our neighborhood. I think this is any parent's nightmare. Police say this stranger even told the girl to not tell her parents after he offered her a Minnie Mouse keychain in $3. He even asked her how she gets to and from school. The girl was able to pull away and thankfully told her parents who then called police. I hope you're caught and I hope you're put away. Right now, police are advising kids to never accept gifts or candy from strangers and never ever leave with the stranger. As for parents, know where your kids are 24 seven and also know their friends names first and last. If anyone knows anything to please let us know and to educate your children on incidents like this about strangers. And police also are encouraging parents don't label your kids items because that could actually give uh, strangers access to knowing your kids names. Again, if you can help ID that suspect and find him, you're asked to call Orlando police right now. And again, we are still waiting for that composite sketch of the suspect. We'll let you know once we learn more. But for now, we're live in Orlando. I'm Jerry Askin getting results. New six.